This morning in studio, we are joined by Sandra Reimer with Central Station. Good morning, Sandra. How are you? Good morning, Nicole. I'm doing well, thanks. Good to hear. We're, we're happy to have you in to talk all things coldest night of the year. First of all, tell us about that awesome toque you're wearing. This toque is, um, they do a new toque every single year. So this year, uh, the theme is take a closer look. So it's like a kaleidoscope on the French. But for those who fundraise $150 or more, they get one of these amazing toques. And you do have the option of no poof, if that's what you would prefer. And children, if they do $75 or more, they get one of these toques. Who wouldn't want an adorable poof on the toque? I know, I know that's what I think. But, you know, you got to have options. For those who uh, maybe don't know or don't remember what Coldest Night of the Year is, explain it for us. Coldest Night of the Year is a fundraiser that Central Station is hosting. But this is a national event. People are going to be walking all across Canada for this. And and also in the states where it's not cold, they also do this fundraiser to where to build awareness of hunger, homelessness, and hurt in the community. Certainly. And Winkler's Walk is coming up on Saturday. What's the day going to look like? On February 24th, we're going to be opening check-in at about 4.30. It's, we're going to be remaining outside, so there's some activities, firefighters, fires, uh, just to keep people going and excited. And then at 5 o'clock, we're going to start the walk. And there's two options for people to walk as well, right? There are, yes. So there's a two kilometer and a five kilometer walk for those who are super ambitious. That's a, an option as well. And you said you're going to be participating in the 2K? I am doing the 2K. I am not ambitious to do the 5K. Hey, you're event coordinator. You got some other stuff <laughs> yes. to do during the evening, yeah, right? Yes, I do. Perfect. But it's not full yet if people want to add to the about 128 walkers, is yes. it? They still can? Yes, they still can. Please go to the website CNO y.org and register it'll prompt you perfectly on how to how to get that done if you're struggling call call, uh, call central station we'll be happy to help perfect sounds good Thank and you. the goal 50k where did that number come from last year we set our goal at 25k I believe, and uh, Winkler responded and responded super well. So this year we figured we're going to double that and aim for 50. And we're coming close. We're at 88% I see here. So um, I'm sure that Winkler will be able to push us over that goal. And that $50,000 is going to go towards general funds, or what's that going to do? It's going to help us with our program, our programming. We do housing and food programming at Central Station. And you've been in and around Central Station about the last six years, but your first year as the event coordinator, yes. it's been going good so far? It has been amazing. The, the people, my team is amazing. They did this last year, so they know what they're doing. Really, I'm just along for the ride and, and trying to help out where I can. Sandra, why should somebody sign up for Coldest Night of the Year? To be a part of community and to support support our community. Winkler's amazing and it's great to be a part of it. Absolutely. Sandra, thanks for coming by today and good luck on Saturday. Thanks, Nicole. Hey, I'm Nicole Clausen. Hopefully you enjoyed that video. If you have something you'd like to share with the Pemina Valley, we'd love to have you on the morning show. Send us an email at news at PeminaValleyOnline.com. And remember, like this video and share it with your friends.